welcome back to the graveyard everybody. I am Will and this is Gaming on the Side. We just got a new corpse which I just buried. I was attempting to prep this one but accidentally, um, completed it. <laughs> well, with all of that being said, it is Wrath Day. We will, during the daytime, go and finish up the quest for the Inquisitor. However, I have finally gotten the response back. Uh, unfortunately, I was recording the prior video while I got the response, and I'm glad to say that I was already thinking of doing the sawmill and whatnot. Uh, as for stone, I don't know exactly how to do the stone up at the top. Uh, maybe that's one of the technologies that I just haven't seen or paid attention to yet. But yes, for one, we will get started on this. Okay, so we already have the axe, we already have the nails, I just need to get some flitch. Excellent, that just means that I need to cut down a tree or two. And that's... That's fine. It's only moderate deforestation. Besides, these trees just magically spring back up. Unnatural, I say. I, I honestly can't wait to get through this game and actually finish it because there are a lot of interesting characters in here and the other portion of this game or of this channel will be character analysis and the first one that I honestly want to run through the ringer is Jerry. I want to know more about the talking skull that helps you through. Does he actually have amnesia? I mean he seems to constantly have you know, memories of all of these other things in the past. He remembers wine, he remembers cake, he remembers onion toast. He remembers multiple different keepers. And yet, he's always so hesitant to talk to you about any of them. Only when it pertains to something that you have finally stumbled upon. Who is Jerry? That's what I want to know. And now... Oh dear. How how large of a scale construction is this going to be? And yeah, no, legit. How many logs will this tree give me? Is this just a forever tree? Wow. Kind of wishing I hadn't buried that body right about now. Oh well. Uh, another thing that I planned on doing, I've already cleaned up the little area for the apiary. Oh right, the refugee camp. It, oh, you guys are happy. Four out of four, huh? Interesting. Considering I haven't brought y'all any... We'll leave y'all alone for a while. <laughs> if I'm being perfectly honest. Uh, actually, no, we're going to steal the honey. Because honey means cake, and cake means super energy. Also, it is plenty late in the day to now go and take care of the Inquisitor. So then, let us continue. And then, hopefully, get a, uh... Get another zombie at some point. Because these are not quite done, but when they are, zombie will be the very first thing that I get. Well, corpses anyways. Alright, now let's see what finishing this quest unlocks for us. Come on, move your stumpy little legs. There he is, how you doing? Here's the firewood. I'm glad to see you're with us in our righteous battle. I will mention nothing about the fact that I am buying stuff from Clotho. And here are the flyers. The stickman figure. Everybody will hear the truth about in will hear about inevitability of the true faith. Yeah, just ask Skull face. 
Anyway, I was planning a burning for today. The witch became too weak, and burning a dead one is too boring. Oh, so you were alive, Scully McSkullface. Stay, let's watch it together. I am so sorry. Oh, that's... Meh, I've seen this a bunch already. This show a bunch already. Yeah, plus I'm getting hungry. Let's go. Y'all are all being... Y'all are leaving in front of the Inquisition. Seems your burning isn't so popular. Five years ago, this place was packed. Whole families came to watch. Seems everybody just got tired of it. Oh, my holy anger keeps the Inquisition... Oh, no! Corpse! Even our blessed Inquisition guards haven't been able to find a new witch for a month. Maybe it's because of the water shortage, but I think it's just a lack of motivation. Speaking of motivation, do you know how to grow grapes? It seems I'm a man of many talents. Good. I have a very important task for you. And this time, you, can't ju you just can't say no. Besides, it will be very profitable for you. I'm listening, Monsignor. I'll grant you the rights to use the eastern slope of Witch Hill to grow grapes. Oh, so th that's a vineyard. But I think the land here, there belongs to the village, not to the Inquisition. No, that vineyard has been in my family for decades. I used to live there with my wife and son. And where are they now? They are dead. Died by the great beast. Witches, I hate them. Oh god. I'm sorry. This is no time for sentimentality. Grow some grape. Make wine. Bring it to me. The guard will then be more motivated and will work with extra zeal. Believe me, when they're drunk, they find a new witch every day. Oh. And once we get enough of them, then we'll need to figure out how to make the burnings more entertaining. I have some thoughts but that I'd like to run by you. Oh, no. Well, of course they find a new one every day when they're drunk. They're drunk! How many symbols are lit up? Only the one now. Okay. Now, you... Uh, so... Right, he wanted me to look at it, but I can't while they're here. Okay, no big deal. Uh, we already had the acid, we turned that in. And, oh, we missed Snake to get the restoration tools. Ah, oh, well. So that means that this house over here... This house with that grave that I found... Oh, no, this is either his son or his wife. But wait, there's only one grave. Does that mean... Did you bury both of your family members in a single grave? That seems a little fucked even for you, Mr. Inquisitor. Oh, right. I no longer have an axe because I used it to... Whoops. Well, I mean, I guess that gives me even more reason to get that grave fixed up. That's really... Yeah, and now here's, here's the vineyard. Yep. Vine trellis, and I happen to have five sticks on me, so yeah, I can just plant another one here. And then zombie porter station that I can have nearby, that way I can have them transported back over to me, I suppose. Okay. Wow, that's... That's why he takes so much pleasure in burning witches, because his house... His house is literally called a burnt house. His family died in a fire, and so he uses fire to enact his own vengeance. Oh my god. That is dark 
I like it. But that is dark. Wow. Now, even though he does leave from time to time up here, I do notice that he stays here more often than not, though. So is he here today, or is it, or is he back on his... No, he's back on his schedule. Oh, well. And once I craft up some armor and a better sword, I'll delve back into the dungeon. But for now, we need to get to the body that was dropped off. I just remembered about that. Oh, my God. Stay away from me, or I'll bite your ass off. You're with the Inquisition now, aren't you? <laughs> no, I don't support the Inquisition. I'm just trying to get home. That's good to hear. Sounds like an honest answer, anyways. I don't like them either. But I bet if someone dug me up for a... But I bet if someone dug me up in a thousand years, there would be one group of people hurting another people, all for the common good. And there would be a saying like, I don't support blah blah blah. <laughs> Son of a bitch. <laughs> You're probably right. Hmm. Sounds like America currently, huh? How topical. Let us bring you back. Oh yeah, are you still rotting or... No, yeah, you're definitely rotted. Okay, let me go get the last of my Zomboid juice. And... Ten more Faith. Just realized, this is really expensive on Faith, because we only had like 20-something. Yeah, we only had 29, and now I'm about to be down to 9. And the last of the zombie juice. Oh boy. Let us make my third and final zombie until I figure out how to make more zombie ju- oh. 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 No. No. <laughs> this is going to be my best zombie by far. Seven skulls. Let's do it. Oh. No! That is such bullshit! Fine, you're getting buried. I need to fill that other spot anyways. I'm not salty, you're salty. That would have been a great zombie. Of course I don't have the energy. <laughs> but at least I did pick up some more honey relatively recently. Boom, that should give us plenty of plenty of energy back. Okay, burial certificate. Let's get let's get this grave all gussied up. In fact, I need to bring a headstone for this one up here as well. So let's go back to Sweet Home and gather the last couple of headstones that I have. Pardon me. Excellent. Well, no zombie for me, sadly. But it's okay. Because at this point in time... Excellent. And that is one, two, three, six out of six, because they each give three. And you are five out of seven. Well, out of six, rather. Because you're still red. Either way, 
Graveyard's up to 63. We've almost broken the 100. Which is amazing. Considering we've only put in like three corpses. And you're still... Yeah, you're definitely still rotting. Alright, so... Something else happened. I don't know what happened. But... Everything in here is just back to being broken. So, if you will give me just a few minutes, I will have all of this back to being repaired, as well as this guy back to being built. So, one moment please. Okay, we got another body for whatever reason. So, we will start with... Darn it, I put up the fit. You're such a good body. Let's at least autopsy you real quick. Once again, gonna be a really good zombie. Yep, that is a six skull zombie, so we are going to have another 15%. Uh, efficiency zombie which is awesome so that means that I will have somebody working up there at that wooden the, the giant tree sawmill anyways which is amazing nope 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 get over here because I don't want it to rot and resurrect and still disappointing. <laughs> well, let us get him up there. Uh, I was at, I actually haven't even been able to really do all that much. I've honestly just been sorting inventories for the most part. Uh, just trying to make sure that everything should be where it should be, because I'm tired of looking for things. Oh no. Oh no. No, bats, leave me alone. I'll be back for your wings in a little bit, I promise. No, I said leave me alone. I will dodge. I have dodged. Hooray. Oh, you cowards. Of course you ran away. terrified that my dodging skills have gotten that much better. Don't worry, I'll take it out on your brethren down in the dungeon at some point. Also, it has come to my attention that I have burned a significant number of bodies and buried a significant number of bodies. Because, um, as I was going through and getting everything into its appropriate place, I have six burial certificates. That's nine silver. <laughs> so after the sermon today, I'll probably go and turn those in. Is there anything? Yeah, the stone repair kits. I'll leave over here with the stone stuff. I would put it in the trunk by the church, but in all honesty, I'd much rather just have my... Uh, my gray fences and headstones there. Okay, let us drop off the blood and zifat. Hmm, right. Ah, screw it. I guess we won't take care of that in this particular episode. I'll probably just do that off camera at some point. But, uh, let me sleep, and then we will do the sermon, and then now that we have the zombie up there doing the logs, I'll also at some point gather the materials, hopefully for a porter for up there, and we'll start getting logs coming down. So, one moment. And we are back and refreshed. 
So, let's get over to the church real quick. Nah, that'll take longer. We'll get to the church, we'll pick up our blessing. No, no, this isn't a church. This is just a secret cult hideout, we all know. I've already explained why. Get that. Get paid. I'd like to say a few words to the cult. Oh, there they are. <laughs> I was getting worried there for a moment. Our cult is great. Here comes the first. And now let us pay for this blessing. Excellent. And I get two more faith. Your donations are welcome. Thank you for your faith, and thank you for paying off my debts. Two silver fifty-two, and that's just from raising it from forty-seven to sixty-three. That's really good. But we still need it to be 200. And we need that to be 50. So, trade. Now. That is something else that I would like to get. A stronger version of this particular prayer. What would that cost me? A prayer for faith. So it would only give me a 30% chance to do that, but I would need gold quality chapters. And for that, I need gold quality stories, right? Yeah. And I think that deals with technology, writing... Yeah, create story. How do I... Story, right here. Ooh, but how do I get that to be of a higher level. Oh, I'll need industrious playwright and writer. I see. Okay, well, how much would it cost me to get those? So here's Playwright, and that will be a hundred blue. Yikes. Writer. Writer will take 40, that's far more doable. But industrious? That sounds like smithing. Apparently not. We already know that it's not in here. Theology, perhaps? No. Huh. Very interesting. Why am I still dragging it? I can just do this. Okay, well... Oh, what is this? Create glue injection. This liquid can be applied to a body. The embalming... Enhancing its characteristics plus white skull. This halts the body's decay. 
This reduces body's decay by 50%. Very nice. Aw. Huh. Well, we will experiment with those at another time. Okay, and since we have that zombie up there... Right, never mind. Let's go back home real quick, and let's make two axes. One for me. And one for the woodcutter, because we do have a quest for him to give him one. And he's usually out pretty late, so... Right. Walk around a little bit. Nope. Right, I did uh, gather our crops. Use dead horse. Down. Hello, guard in the dark. That is forever your name. Yes, they can sleep. You learned a new sentence! Good for you! I've, I'm happy for him. Did you? No. Okay. Here you are. I have a nicer axe for you. I'll give you two recipes. Pasta and lasagna. That will be all you need to keep cutting trees all day long. Vegetarian? Meat is expensive. The trick is in slow-releasing carbs. Lentils have even better protein. Whatever you say, dude. Is there anything else? Nope. Just, just leave. Wait, did that really raise my friendship to... No, I have no friendship with this man. Okay, fine. Oh, right. I never did go back and talk with Cory. Well, his brother is still out here, so maybe... Maybe I'm not too late. No! I shouldn't have said anything. Alright, well, you know what? We'll... We will at least end the day on a high note. We will head back down to the church cellar, and we will get a new piece of alchemy machinery... And then I will probably call it for the video. So I picked up, yes, I picked up the complex iron parts, distillation cube. This, oh my god, it really doesn't, nothing fits over here because you're just smack dab in the center. I'm gonna put you right there. gonna break my heart to have to break these things down later to replace them with their better counterparts. These things are expensive. Excellent. Absolute. Wait a minute. Maybe this is where I can change the hearts and whatnot. How much inventory is there? One, two, three, four. I have... Six. I don't think I have any more than six hearts, so this should be perfect. Yeah, I only have four. Excellent! Maybe this is where I can use the hearts now. I wonder what they will create. Come on, show me something. Yes! Oh, this takes time. Okay, well then, I will see you back when it is done. And it's just about done, and life extract. Let's study this. Because we can. 
life extract, and it only takes science. How much blue will I get? Not a lot, only five, but at least now we, uh, we can do some things. Oh yeah, I may as well get a lot of these done and out of the way. Oh, fluid or essence. That gave quite a bit. No, no, no. And you know what? I think we'll do at least one more thing before we leave. Oh wait, no, never mind. We cannot. I still need one red wine. I forgot. Okay, well, that is going to be it for this video. Thank you all for watching. I've had a blast playing this game. I've been Will, you guys have been awesome, and I will catch all of you later.